Before starting my video, I'd like to give a loud big shout out to Steve Craig Retro Games. He's a new uh, fellow that's been following me on my channel. And the other guy I'd like to give a sh loud shout out to is Contagious Collections. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe to their channel. Let's get started with this video. So I'm going to be trading these games away. One, uh, so all these were all gotten just recently um from that garage sale find that i did i know it's been a couple of weeks since i've done a video game pickup tour but i decided to do something i got the vgp uh, i don't have a car but i just got here um this is the location right here and this is where i usually trade in all my games uh so we're gonna see what we have currently i have 170 dollars trade credit with this added on I might get an extra uh, trade credit boost so let's see what I find today with me. so I'm here in VGP I just wanted to know these top games here are brand new and sealed so I'm not really gonna buy these ones uh, but I wanted to know uh, what games are good for the PSP because the PSP is the only system right now I'm playing because I've been taking the subway everywhere so just let me know if you find a game that I should maybe purchase uh, VGP actually has excellent deals on their PSP titles. Um, so I'm just trying to see what games I should get. Uh, this vi video game pickups will be a little bit more different. I won't be showing the games right away what I get. I'll be showing them a little while later. Uh, I do want to get this game, but uh, I think 19.99 is a little bit too high. But it is a good game. Um, so still the games continue here. And these are like the lower end title games. But yeah, guys, let me know. Uh, the PSP is uh, one of my favorite systems. So, you got the trade of $38, so I gave you five on that one. Five? Okay. Yeah. So their 3DS collection's really small, uh, just because everyone's been buying 3DS games off of them. So I don't know what I'll be getting, but I did get a few 3DS games. So that's going to be cool. This is just their regular DS games. I don't really buy the filler titles for my collection, so I've been trying to avoid those as much as possible. Um, so that's that. And this is their Wii U titles. I do have a ton of them already, so I am I'm trying to do a full completion set. And the GameCube stuff's mostly filler titles, so I'm not really focusing on those at the moment. Uh, but in terms of PS Vita, they're the only place that has this much amount of PS Vita games. These are all brand new PS Vita games, so they're actually really good. All of them are sealed. Unfortunately, they have a really small, small selection of used titles, which are all over here. So I don't know what game is good, So and I don't know too much about the PSP Vita games uh, to play, so I don't know which one to buy. But I did want to buy a Final Fantasy one, but it got sold. And with these games that I traded in, I got $38 trade credit, plus I have $170. So we'll see what I get today, and I'll show you at the end of the video what I got from the shop. The games I got for GameSwap are the following. So I got the game Sonic Rivals. And by the way, they had a sale buy two, get one free. So these are the games I got. The second game is another copy of Mega Man X Collection. That was also $9.99. Uh, so I'm really happy to get that. I will be trading that away to my buddy Fabio Games. The second game I got was Star Wars Battlefront. I know this is more of a common game, but I didn't have this. And I actually start playing the 360 now, so I've been playing that a lot more, so I got that. Uh, I got a rare game. I can't believe I got this and they misquoted the price, but it's going up in price on eBay This is going between 30 to 40 dollars now uh, Smack down here comes a pain. So if anyone does see this game at yard sales grab it. It's a really good game uh, Also, I got a couple of 3ds games, but I'll show you those later. I got this uh, Final Fantasy game although I have this game. I thought the price was really good. I'll be uh, trading that away so that was pretty cool. I did get two PS Vita games. They are, they are uncommon titles. I haven't seen them. So the first one is Mind. It's kind of like an RPG game. Sort of a weird game. And then I got this other game. Tearaway. So I only got these just because I don't have many PSP games. So I did get that. 
Um, the next game I got was Yakuza. So that's for the PS3. I haven't come across that one. And I do know Yakuza games are really fun. They're pretty much like you're playing with zombies and you're killing them. So that was really good. I'm really happy to acquire that. Um, for the DS, uh, I just got another game, which is Pokemon uh, Conquest. Although I have this game already, I thought it was a good game to have. I always like to have multiple copies of Pokemon games. You never know who you can trade them to. The next game after that, I got Castlevania. This is the only N64 game I got, and I've been looking for this game forever. I know it's not the greatest game, but uh, I was just really happy to get this. Um, going on to the DS games, I got uh, two games for the new 3DS. Uh, so that will be showing. I'll show that later. Uh, I did get this game right here, this Transformers game. So big shout out to my friend uh, Transformers and Games. You should check out his channel. He's a really cool guy, and he loves Transformers. So I don't know if he has this game, but if, uh, M, you have this game, let me know how it is. I looked at the back. I really like the graphics, so I decided that I'll get it. Um, the next game I got is a pretty uncommon game. I've never come across this. Uh, Project Mira DX. Uh, it came with these cool cards. Um, so I got some cool cards in there. Um, so... I don't think I am ever going to play this, but I did just got this for the collection. I think it's like a dance on karaoke sort of game. Um, so yeah, I got this uh, just because I've never heard of it. Maybe it's going to be worth a lot of money. Who knows? Um, I got another Shin Miyagi game. So this is a Shin Miyagi game. I don't know too much about it. Once again, I judge the game by its cover. I don't know if this is going to be any good, but all the time I've played Shin Miyagi games, they've been really fun. So I did get that. Uh, the next two games I got were for the new 3DS. And the first game I got was Minecraft. So I know Minecraft games are always really fun. So I did get this. So I hope it's going to be a really good game. Uh, I do plan on playing this when I get the new 3DS. And the best pickup from this whole entire lot, um, once again, I did only paid uh, $20 out of my pocket for all these games. Uh, the next game I got was Xenosaga, uh, or Xenoblades Chronicles for the 3DS. This is once again for the new 3DS. Um, and this is probably the best game. Uh, my buddy Sam, who works at the store, said every time he puts this game out, it's sold. In matter of like hours. So I ended up getting their last copy of this game. I'm super stoked and super excited. Um, this was the receipt that I got. So as you can see. These were the games I paid money for. Well I didn't really pay money for. I had um, I had uh, trade credit for these. And these were the games that were pretty much free. So Yakuza was for free. Star Wars Battlefront, Sonic Rivals, Project Mira DX, Castlevania. So those are the five games I got. And these were the ten games I ended up uh, paying the cash for. So we'll also get on to the pickup of the week. So well, well, what do you know? I'm back to yard sailing. I found an N64 with uh, these games right here. And uh, what would you like on these, sir? 55. 55 all right I think that that's uh, fair enough so not bad for a beautiful yard sale which is right here so for the n64 lot I got five memory cards so these are the memory cards that I got the following games I got were quake that is game and box no manual Hexen, Rush, San Francisco Rush Extreme Racing, complete. So that goes for about like 50 bucks. Uh, Revolt on eBay I saw was for 50 bucks. And the best game from the lot was uh, Duke Nukem 64. So these were the five games that I got. And I got the system with um n64 sadly no rumble pack and i got these two controllers here these are a little loose the sticks but nevertheless um 
that's what I got. The box is in okay condition. There's a little bit of rips there. But uh, overall, like, it was in pretty good condition overall. And this is the back of the N64. So that was really good. It came with this paperwork right here. So that there as well as I believe this is the manual. So overall, that was for 55 bucks. And the story behind this was I was going to the bank and I saw a sign for yard sales. So I went for it and 55 bucks I got this. So not a bad score. Um, like, comment, and subscribe. I was surprised I even made a video this week uh, due to the lack of content, but I'm really happy. Um, I'll be going next week to Fabio Games and I'll be trading these away or the week after whenever I get time. I'll be trading this away and I may be going one more uh, stop to the my favorite store, VGP. So uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys whenever we see you guys. Take care. Thanks. Good.